Welcome back, everybody. Back with some more Star Valor. And why does it say we're not in the safe zone? I'm not sure. All right. Well, let's um. I guess my needs to get a little XP. I want to jump to higher level zone. So we use some higher level quests to get more money. Yeah, I think that'll be better. I think it was here. Yeah, this is it. I can't see anything. Somebody here is sparking. Where are you? I don't know if you can see this on the video, but there is stuff here. Um, I think I think the best way to do this is just to get a light. So that's what I'll do. Just buy a light. Trade. Spotlight. Put that in the ship. Didn't cost us anything. Sell that. Store all these. Oh, saved. Amazing. Well, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, and most importantly, use the link in the description for freecash.com. Using that link gets you three loot boxes that have up to $250 in them each. And most importantly, using freecash.com earns you free cash. Do surveys daily, you know, that kind of thing. Just do surveys. Do surveys earn money. All right, let's get to a higher quest. Oh, there's a fight. There's a fight. Um, I would love to go up here, actually. So if I can go to 2719, which isn't that one. That's 2623. That's backwards. That's here, I think. Oh, no, that's... That's somewhere else. I don't know where that is. Not sure. I'm not sure, but we need to go to higher level zones. Basically, we'll scavenge our way to victory here. Um, if I go to perks, knowledge, tech level's five. So we're actually not bad. Oh, you have a local delivery. That we need to do. Let's do it. It's just gonna get us over to the other side. No problem. No problem. We're at level nine. Tech level 5. Tech level's low. So we need to get our tech level up. Tech level gets up by scavenging. So if I could find, like, a dead system that has a ton of scav scavenge in it, up to level 10, it looks like I could do, then we're okay. Basically, it has to be within a few levels of your own level for you to actually get benefit from it. At least you get tech from it. Wow, this is, uh, pretty far light. There we go. Thanks for the money. Ah, this region. Can I actually get there? In 12 minutes or something. That's far. No, I don't have enough. I need a lot of energy cells, but I don't think we jump far enough on a De deuterium station. Ah, deuterium. Well, if I get more energy, so batteries, I can actually jump some distance without needing energy cells. So if I can find like a better battery somewhere, that would do it. Right now I'm just looking for jump gates. Ooh, some junk. Don't mind if I do. Cargo's at 45%. Not bad. Okay, we're full up on scavenging. That's all 10 we want. This is it. This is not it. This is this is definitely the wrong one. <laughs> uh, scout mission's done. There's a pirate right here. Got him. Where is this place? Where am I? Oh yeah, that went south. Uh, I can I can actually jump here. We'll jump there and we'll go back because we have our mission. We'll charge up our warp cell here and jump on back to where we need to be in a second. Just need more energy cells. Right now, it costs us fuel, essentially, in the form of energy cells to do anything. Thanks for a better deuterium warp drive. That's actually kind of amazing. Um, eliminate pirates. Yeah, these are low-level pirates. Should be fine. And if I just stash materials... That's good. I could sell these. Um, I'm going to 
scrap. Just destroy the junk. No, I'll sell the junk. I need money. I'll sell this one, or will I scrap it? I will scrap it. Get some XP from it. Um. Ooh. Can we use a drone weapon? No. Might make sense to start using some missiles, though. Put the lasers in the center. And run some missiles. 280 range. Not very much. Projectile speed. It's slow, too. But they do a lot of damage. Mass disruptor deals more or less damage based on target's mass. Uh, is that more damage based on more mass? More damage based on less mass? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. That'd be interesting. What does it require? I think it requires explosives to craft one of them. So I need large warhead. Oh, torpedoes. Torpedoes are really slow, I think. Railgun, yeah, that'd be cool. So one large warhead. Uh, if I compare it to... Compare it to a demolisher missile. So here's a demolisher missile, here's one large warhead. Tech level's four, M level's nine. Takes two missiles, space is two, so it's probably two large warheads. So I'm gonna add another one. So now it's space is the same. Damage is slightly higher. Explosion radius is higher. Speed's better, range is better. This is just better, it needs six microchips though. For one explode. Energy cost per shot, ammo needed, materials needed, damage. So what if I do more explode? Like, three explode. How's the uh, explosion radius is 12. That's huge. Now it takes even more. <laughs> this thing's giant. <laughs> you can make it faster too. Oh, I gotta take some of these out. Uh, you can make a rapid fire, you can time fuse, make them heavy. Uh, but I can speed them up. So I can do that for the cost of nickel. And now the speed is 60 on these things. This is a large warhead missile launcher. Also has mass disruptor. Uses four missiles per shot, though. Damage is 59. It's not that much damage. It's kind of low. For how big it is, it's kind of low. You'd have to shoot a lot of these to do something. I guess one thing you can do is, like, rapid fire them. Instead of speed, you can do rapid fire, I'm thinking. I can get three rapid fire in there. Oh, I only have one missile now. So that's a Gatling missile launcher. Uses one missile. Does six damage per, but shoots so fast. Instead of every five seconds, it shoots one and a half seconds. One and a half shots per second. Eh. Eh. It's damage is really low. You'd have to like heavy mouth. I can't. I can't do this. Can't use missiles yet. Okay, let's um. Oh, let's get some energy cells. And then do some delivery. What's this one? Where do you want me to go? Out to here? How would I get there? In t five minutes. I'd have to... I'd have to jump here. I can jump within this circle. So maybe I'd be able to jump there? I don't actually know. The other thing I could do would be... To upgrade... Oops, to upgrade this. But that doesn't seem like it's worth it. Um, the battery... Do they have a big battery? Do they have small batteries? Hmm. None of this is very good. None of this is very good at all. Plays a sound with detecting loot. I mean... I don't have one. I don't have one of these either. That also increases our warp distance. I don't have a debris analyzer, so we should get that too. Got a little basics. Sensor power, more parsecs. 
Um, if I do this, right now, we're, actually, it's probably better just to do more shields. What do we got? I got three points left. Probably better to do another shield. Yeah, we'll do one of those, and I'll do one shield charger. This way I'll have seven shields going up. Yeah, that's fine. I could build another one of those lasers. Reset. Blue laser. Um, what did I build it with? How come it's using three blue crystals? Oh, did I do a two blue? Yeah, it was a two blue laser core. It's a two laser. So then I just get a second one of those. Yeah, let's do that. Um, I have boosters, though. So, like, making them better. What's this? Mass disruptor. Automatic targeting. Well, those are new. There's burst as well. I don't have burst yet. Armor piercing would be cool. Can't get that. Armor penetration. Yep. Overload makes it more heat. Heavy mount makes it... Well, actually, I can make it a one core blue with a heavy mount. So now it takes two space. Does less damage than the other laser, but it's a heavy laser. So its range should be higher. Let me go to my two laser here. So I clicked on two laser. Yeah, item comparison. Here we go. Range is 90. So now range is now 130. It's just a little too hot. The shot's the same. Damage is less. But that range is so good. Now I can throw a heat sink onto it to cool it down a little. I'll need bismuth for that. But then I can range it some more or get a crit or something. Crit needs copper. The other option is rapid fire. So it's a rapid heavy laser. Shoots even faster. Damage goes up. Heat goes up. I have to heat it. Cool it down. Can I rapid fire it some more? No, I'm running out of stuff. Uh, I like this idea. It'll shoot really fast. It'll overheat, though. Damage is less, but the rate of fire is double. Seven bismuth, bismuth, one microchip. Do you have any bismuth in your goods area? You do. Oh, that's expensive. Yikes. Okay. Never you mind. Never you mind, heavy rapid. Get out of here. We're just gonna do two blue core. Oh, I need six blue. I'm just sitting here wasting my time. Because I need some friggin' stuff. Oh, there's a red crystal in here. Come in handy. Fire. Fire all the guns. There's the blue crystal I need. There's some nickel. Can now mine silver. That does something else for us. Bismuth. Bismuth is going to be. Bismuth is going to be big. Let's get this crystal. This thing. There we go. Now loot only lasts for five minutes. In case you're wondering if it just stays there forever, it only stays on the map for five minutes. Limitation of the game engine. So you do need to pick it up. Eventually. And... Come on, just get a little more blue core. Blue crystal. I want to get that next weapon. There it is. Give me the blue crystals. Gray ore is worth money. Gray ore is worth money. Alright. Moving on. Moving on. Got 2,000 bucks. So I have... 
Okay, I have enough blue crystals, so we can make this. The two laser. I need some microchips. Build me a two laser, please. Go to the hangar. Let's uh, unequip the light lasers. Unequip those. I'm gonna put the two laser in. Actually, yeah. We're gonna take the mining lasers, put them out here so they have range for some reason. Put you out there. I'm gonna put you in and you in. So the two lasers now in the center doing maximum damage. And I got PD out there. I actually can put you back on, but I think I'm gonna scrap you both. There we go. Stash materials. Fine, whatever. Um, I need another PD laser. You might have one. He's got one. So we'll throw that. Second PD laser. Yeah, there we go. There we go. So now these guns are here, and here it is. So it's going to be a little harder to shoot down missiles. But I think we'll be okay. All right. Let's get some energy and we'll start jumping around. There we go. I have a little bit of money. Buy some more. Let's do this. I think we can do it. I think we can do it. We'll warp here first. Eliminate Notorious Pirate. Yeah, well... I don't think I have time before we charge to go to the next one. Because we only have like a minute on this mission. Oh, I can't jump there. I gotta jump here. Eight points. We're charging. We're at 69 charge, so that's fine. We'll, uh, we'll fly up. Maybe we can kill this guy in time? Maybe. We should just jump. This is against my better judgment. Get him. Get him, get him, get him. Get him, get him, get him. Thank you. Jump here. Do one more charge. We'll just do a quick explore while we charge up. Wee. Yeah, we gotta go. Gotta go here quick. Okay. There might be something here, but I don't know. Warp drive ready. Let's jump. Ooh, go go go. I don't know what the time is. Okay, well this is a good sign. We'll come back to you in a minute. No stopping. No stopping. Look at us. Look at us getting all this wonderful stuff. Fire. I just shoot once when I click. Interesting. It shoots twice like that. We did it. So now we get the shoes. I'm gonna choose a shield generator. Ooh, look at all this. Okay, we're definitely doing this one. Um, I'm gonna eliminate the notorious pilot. Sure. And let me put on my new, my new lovely shield. Oh, this is with one. Okay, well, let's unequip you. We'll equip the blue one. The blue one you can see is way better. It's 50% better for the same weight. Uses a little more energy. Nope, same energy too. Just better. Just better. So actually, upgrading... There's a Heavy Impulse Drive 2, I think. That exists. I think. Well, anyways, I can burn this down. Yeah, we can scrap this for some tech XP. And... Doesn't make sense to upgrade this. Well, I do have one upgrade yet, so I may as well... Uh, get the extra speed. 
Yeah. Do you have the better capacitor? That's a collector beam. Energy barrier is pretty good. Loot finder. That's a loot filter. Oh, here's the drone bays. So these drone bays, they give you, um, they let you pop out drones and they do things. This one heals you, but there are others that do other things. Ooh, armor 55. Repair system efficiency plus 2%. Station repair cost minus 2%. Wow, sword stream plating is amazing. It makes our ship really slow. Ooh, large gyroscope. We're using only two in gyro. This will give us 42 turning power. That's amazing. We're using the heavy nuclear and all stuff. And a bunch of pirates just showed up. And there's a heavy laser. There's a Gatlin Vulcan. This does, uh, it, it ignores shields. It goes straight to, uh, to damaging hull, which can be nice if something has really heavy shields. Wow. Okay, I'm going to sell the great ore. You know what? Screw it. I'll just sell this stuff too. Not bad. Not bad. A raven. A hound. It's a corvette. It's like the one we have now. But ours is blue. So it has minus 10 heat generated and extra projectile speed and energy damage and HP regeneration per five seconds. It's pretty good. If I use this, locked, buy it, equip to unlock. I've never used a hand before. Cost 32,000 bucks. Who's got that kind of money? Who's got that kind of money? All right, let's hit this debris field 10. This seems to be the right thing to do. Um, kind of does make sense to upgrade the heavy drive for speed. Okay, let's hit the brakes. Pump the brakes. Ooh, we've got an upgrade kit. That's good. We'll go deal with these guys in the south here, which will be nice. Yeah, maybe there'll be another base. That's, uh, ooh, debris field. Debris field 13, so this will have junk and energy cells, but the fact that it has energy cells is actually really good for us. Won't get any tech level out of it. But we got some energy cells, which is nice. Oh, we did get some XP. All right, let's fight this guy. Ow. Yeah, fighting at a distance is best for us. Boom, toast. Get out of here, nerd. It's time. It's time to increase damage. Level 11. So this one might be within striking distance. That one's not. I. It might be two levels. I don't actually know. Could be basing a tech level as well. It might be basing a tech level now that I think about it. Our tech level's low. It's uh, six or seven. Eat it, eat it, eat it, eat it, eat it. Who else is here? There's another one somewhere. It's a medium laser, okay. Ah, it's this guy. Ooh. You actually have to hit him. Get your lasers out of here. Oh, they do so much damage. Yikes, yikes, yikes. Yikes. We're gonna die! Look at our ship just getting beat to a pulp. I have no buttons to push to, like, save me. Alright, we actually cannot kill that guy. Maybe I can. I don't know. We're gonna find out. Keeping the peace. What a notorious pirate. You want fruit and vegetables. I don't have any. Gotta repair. 500 bucks to repair. My... My, my, my. This medium laser uses 12. I'm just gonna scrap it for tech. We'll sell the junk. I need the money. Uh, looks like I do need this. We'll get less 
hull points, but we'll get more repair systems efficiency and armor. So we'll upgrade our plating. And I'll just scrap this one. Uh, what else can I do? What's a debris two? Wow. Any other things I could do here? Warp diverter will give us a warp charge, which is pretty good. A heat sink is really good too. Pack booster won't help us. Yeah, none of these things will help us. The only thing that will help us really is upgrading our weapons. So, let's actually spend some, spend some, you got microchips? Yes, you do. So if I buy two microchips, I should be able to craft a single one of these. Because we have a bunch of base components, which means I can then go to the hangar and upgrade each one of these lasers. Oh, I unequipped it. What am I doing? I'm supposed to be upgrading you. So now I do more damage. And I can use the improved kit to upgrade it again. Yeah, I think that's going to be a good idea. And we can see the difference between the two. So you see 47 damage per second, 36 per hit, versus this one. So it gains an extra 7 damage per hit. Wow. Wow, I can actually make it purple if I use the Ancient Relic, but I'm not going to do that just yet. Okay, let's give this guy a try. The old college try here. Ugh, oh, I can't strafe. Don't you hit me. Don't you hit me. So I move towards him. Ah, he dodged. No, two hits. Okay, I think I got him. I think I got him. Oh, he's going fast. He's going fast. Why is he running? Ow, 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 ow. Okay. Got him. Four base components is really good, too. So let me heal 17 per tick. It's pretty good. The armor was definitely helpful. We were made out of squish before. We're no longer made out of squish. Uh, Red Holocron has tons of XP. Large battery, though. Gives us a lot of power, which I kind of need, but the tech level, I'll take the tech level, I'll take the tech level, so we'll just scrap it, and it gave us 418 salvage, that's amazing, yes, I want, oh, improved plating would be really good too, but extra weapon space is good, damage is good, everything's good. Okay, let's go to the other one, and we'll, uh, we will get our quest here. I'm also going to get the batteries, the uh, energy, and how's Tinker going? He's level 15. So these guys do level up over time. Turkey Bojangles, <laughs> not so great. And you can have ships that have tons of crew. You'll see when we get to the next ship level. Oh wait, did he... Experience received minus 40%, but tech received increased. So the tech received increase from him is going to be good. We want to get the tech 50 basically as fast as we can. That's the best thing to do, really. Get your tech up really fast. Get to the high level stuff. Get, uh, get cool ships. Nothing cool here. Mm -mm -mm. So what are we going to trade? Well, we're not doing any big trades yet. We have 5,000 bucks, though. Hostile warping. Uh, these are level 13s. These level 13s. Oh boy, oh boy. They're really hard to shoot these missiles. But at least I can. Got one. We do it. Can we do it? Now we're gonna take that. I want PD lasers because <laughs> they don't miss. How about this guy? He's got missiles, right? Oh no, he's got tons of lasers. 
He's eating it though, he's eating four lasers. Okay, perfect. Oh, the timer, look at that. What was that fight for? Why are they chasing me? How's my rep? Red Skull Pirates are mad. I need to do some things for Red Skull. And I need to piss off the uh, Syndicate a little bit. Yeah, I need to fight the Syndicate a little bit. So we'll go find some Syndicate um, trader guys, and we'll beat them up. Before we go and make anyone else happy. Rapid medium laser. That's 8%. This is medium laser. We can get that over time. I'll take this. Keeping the pieces here again? Oh, it's done already. Impact 914. Battle computer 2. Huge battery. Take the battle computer 2, please. I'll eliminate Nor Notorious Pirate. Yes. And I would love to get... Hmm. Look at that. Minus 4.5% mass. But this would be good. I don't know if thrusters I don't need. You have two minutes to get where? Uh. It doesn't say. It doesn't say. Yeah, it doesn't say. Anyways, we'll deal with it in the next episode. See you there!